Hey guys, hats off to Deborah Lewis, who says she didn't even know what a Nintendo Switch was, but after a quick Google search, found out that they're quite the hot commodity and pretty pricey. Deborah Lewis expects deliveries at her door regularly. And those are my formula. So they come quite often every two weeks and then there's bags, uh, feeding bags. She receives several shipments of medical supplies a week, but the latest delivery was more than she expected. I opened it up and there were six games and I'm like, I didn't order this. Six highly sought after Nintendo Switch game consoles. I, I thought, well, this would be great to give to my grandkids, but it's not the right thing. Sure. So I wanted to do the right thing, so uh. that's why we worked it out and tried to find out who it belonged to. The problem, the box has had two shipping labels, one with her address and the other for a nearby Target store on Ray and 48th Street. The driver must have only seen hers. She and her caregiver are determined to do what's right. If you did not order anything, I would suggest checking one of your cards. Maybe you were charged accidentally um, or something like that. If not, you can just come to the store. Alrighty, appreciate it, thanks. They called Target. I'm not sure. I guess just waiting on that call, waiting to see what they say. Maybe they'll call and say they'll come and get them. I thought they would say that right away, but we'll see. Millions of packages will be making their way all over the country ahead of the holidays. Mailboxes in Moore and Ahwatukee and UPS have tips to keep track of them. Number one, write down that tracking number. Two, know which carrier or company is shipping your package. Three, be sure the recipient and return address are accurate. Check it twice like Santa checks his list. Also, many delivery services and companies have secure drop-off locations and lockers to avoid them being left on your front porch inviting those porch pirates. As for Deborah, the grandmother of eight says this would have made for easy Christmas shopping, but she's determined to make sure they get back to where they're supposed to go. It's been like about four days, and we thought maybe they might come back, say, oh, did we leave this here? So really having a hard time figuring out how do you return it? Rachel Cole, 12 News.